There's another way of copying and pasting image elements when you have a selection active, um, and that's by using the Move tool with the Option or Alt key. Um, so in this demonstration, I've got, again, kind of another simple image to use. I'm going to go ahead and use the Quick Selection tool um, to make my selection of the feathers. And I'm just going to do a rough selection um, and just so I can um, do this relatively quickly. And I'll refine it just a little bit here because you don't want it to be too rough. And with this background and the texture of this background, it doesn't need to be as perfect as in maybe another image. Um, if you have something with a simpler background, it might be um, something that you need to refine the selection a lot more. In this case, the selection um, doesn't need to be perfect, but I do want it to be closer to the edges of the feather um, so I can blend it a little bit be better into the background. Um, so in this case, with the, with the selection active, like I said, you can use the Move tool. So I'm going to go over here and pick up the Move tool. And um, actually, before I do that, I'm going to take this one step further for best practices. I'm going to duplicate the background um, and do all my copying and pasting on the background copy and not the original background so I can preserve the integrity of my image. So. Using the Move tool, again, I'm going to hold down the Option or Alt key and click and drag. And this creates a duplicate of that selection and moves it and pastes it to where I end up um, releasing the click. And it does it differently. If you notice here, it just copies and pastes it onto that same layer. Um, unlike the copy and paste before, when you paste um, and even paste special, it um, creates and generates a new layer for that. So um, this is a, you know, another option for you for copying paste and pasting. And with the selection still active, I can actually do it a number of times. Um, I can, if I use the Option or Alt key and click and drag and hold down the Shift key, I can keep it um, on a straight line so I can keep it so it lines up and to a certain spot that I need. Um, and again, I can do that and continue to do that um, to add more image elements and combine this image element within my photograph. Um, and again, it does it differently, but it's worth a try. And these are the things that you should be practicing um, in the skills practice and sharing with the rest of the class.